This morning, the CIAC is investigating claims students from East Catholic High School yelled racial slurs at opposing cheerleaders. Yeah, Eyewitness News spoke exclusively to one of the alleged victims last night. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Suzanne and has been closely following this story for us. Roger, what did the cheerleader say? Well, good morning, guys. Yeah, it's truly disturbing, these allegations. A Montville cheerleader named Nadia tells us she was excited about her high school's first road game of the season, but she says after a tense contest, some East Catholic students stomped on their bags and then, worst of all, called some of the cheerleaders a racial slur. The disgusting allegations marred what should have been a night worth celebrating. East Catholic topped Montville in a thrilling overtime game on Friday night. But after the final whistle, a junior Montville cheerleader named Nadia tells Eyewitness News that some members of East Catholic's football team began stomping on the bags of Montville's cheer team. Nadia says the cheerleaders got their things quickly and tried to leave, but as they headed to the bus, she says some East Catholic students began yelling racial slurs. It's three or four kids that said, go home, N-word, go home, N-word to me, and they were just screaming. Montville superintendent has demanded an investigation, and the CIC is looking into the incident. East Catholic is also investigating, but the school's president does not believe racial slurs were used. In a statement, he writes in part, We continue to investigate issues raised at last Friday's football game against Montville High School. And while we do not believe anything inappropriate was said, we take this matter seriously. But Nadia's mom, Montessa, believes her daughter is telling the truth because she says Nadia called her right afterwards crying hysterically. Of course, my heart broke for her because she was so upset. It's the first time she's ever like had that type of experience and she was scared. Now, Nadia and her family did not want us to use their last names. The CIAC's director hopes to have an update on this investigation within the next 72 hours. By the way, you can read full statements from both East Catholic and Montville High School leaders on the Channel 3 app. Live in the studio, Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.